Chapter Rabbi Yisrael explains the hidden meaning of the holy petik. Rabbi Yisrael abounds in laughter. The Ben Rebbe Nachman of Breslov, he is our Rebbe and the Rebbe of all the people of Israel. He has all sorts of advice, all sorts of healings for each and every one according to what he needs. The Rabbi already prepared the Kita Maran for us, the Kita Tfilis, the Kita Halachas, the Kita Eitzes. He already prepared everything for us, for each and every one, the healings and the salvations and the rectifications. And the Rebbe, one needs to search a great deal for our Rebbe. A Rebbe who can help us, the Rebbe of all the world is Rebbeini. Rebbe Nanach Nachmo, Nachmo Yiman, he's the Rebbe of the whole world, of all of Israel. He's the Rebbe of the Torah and of all Israel. Fortunate are we, how good is our portion that we have such a Rebbe. You know who said this? Nanach Nachmo, Nachmo Yiman, they have no choice. They need to wait until the coming of the Mashiach. I cannot leave here before. I cannot go from here until the Mashiach comes. What? What do you think? Nanach Nachmo. Very hard was it for me to descend to you, my precious student, to tell you that I greatly enjoyed your service, and about you I said, my fire will burn until the coming of the Mashiach. Who revealed this? Rabbeinu revealed this. We do not know even one letter, only Rabbeinu revealed this. Do you know who I am? I am Nanach. Nachma, Nachma, Miman. I will reveal to you who I am. I am Nanach, Nachma, Nachma, Miman. You don't know who I am. I am Nanach, Nachma, Nachma, Miman. I will reveal to you who I am. I am Nanach, Nachma, Nachma, Miman. You know who I am. No, you don't know. I will reveal it to you. I am Nanach, Nachma, Nachma, Miman. That is me. All the world does not know who I am. It is not so hard. Where is the television? Where is the Yediot Tachronot, a major Israeli newspaper? Where are they? Why don't they know who I am? We need to proclaim to the whole world who I am. I am Nanach Nachma, Nachma Miyuman. All the world, all the government do not know who I am. I will reveal to you here and now who I am. I am Nanach Nachma, Nachma Miyuman. We need to proclaim to all the world. They do not know who I am. I am Nanach Nachma, Nachma Miyuman. I am Nanach Nachma, Nachma Miyuman. That is everything. You don't. You don't already know who I am. All the world does not know who I am, and I will reveal it to you. I am Nanach, Nachma Nachma Miyuman. The television people have still not come. What is with them? They have no sense. All the television people need to come here. I am Nanach, Nachma Nachma Miyuman. I, I am revealing to you what the whole world does not know. I am revealing to you. I am Nanach, Nachma Nachma Miyuman. All the world does not know and does not know who I am. All the world does not know and does not know who I am. I will reveal to you who I am. I am Nanach Nachmo. Nachmo Miyuman. That is all. Who is, the, who is Rabbi Nachman? Chapter part. Who is Rabbi Nachman? How did the Patek come to this world? Nanach Nachmo. Nachmo Miyuman. Nobody knows the secret of this. Only Rabbeinu revealed that he is Nachman. He revealed our vitality and hope and all our essential vitality and that of all Israel. He encompasses all the Torah and all the Siddiquim and all the holiness. Nanach Nachmo. Nachmo Miyuman encompasses the creation of all the world, all the Torah and all the Siddiquim and all the wonders and all the lights are included in this. Yes. Oy vey. This will create a new world. He is already in the world. Thank God. Nanach Nachmo. Nachmo Miyuman. Nanach Nachmo. Only Rabbeinu revealed this. No one else knows. No one else knew of this secret. Not even one Sadik knew of this secret. Only Rabbeinu alone. Only he revealed this. You know who I? You know who is Nachman? It is Nanach. Nachman, Nachman, Yuman. That is everything. Only Rabbeinu revealed. You know who is Nachman? I am Nachman. I, 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 I am Nanach, Nachman, Nachman, Yuman. I, I, I. I, I, I am Nanach Nachum Nachum Yuman. I, 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 I am Nanach Nachum Nachum Meuman. Yes. Only he revealed this secret. This is a secret hidden from all the world, and he himself revealed to us. You know who is the Rebbe of all the world, of all Israel? Rebbe Nachman of Breslov. Nanach Nachma, Nachma Miyuman. Rebbe himself revealed this. What is Nachman? Nachman.
Nachman is me. Nanach, Nachmo, Nachmo, Miman, that is me. There is no other. The part I already signed my name. And I, I already signed my name. Nanach, you know what is Nanach? Well, tell us. If you know, then tell us. What is Nanach? Now you can say what you want. I already said my name. Nanach, what is Nanach? I am Rosh B'nai Yisrael, the head of the, children, of the children of Israel, the initials of Rebbe. I am the Rebbe. Who is the Rebbe? Nanach, Nachmon, Nachmam, Yuman. I say, I am everything. I say, I am everything. You know who I am. I am Rosh B'nai Yisrael, the initials of Rebbe. You know about this. I am the Rebbe. Yes. You do not know me. Who I am? I am Nanach, Nachmon, Nachmam, Yuman. He will laugh. To, he will say to all the world that you don't know what is Nanach. How would you know? How can you help? How how would you know? How can you help? Saba laughs. Nanach, nachmo, nachmami, yuman. There's an illustration in the book, Map of the Holy Grave of Rabbi Yisrael Beredesa. For everything, every matter you need, come to me and I will show you, and I will show you how everything. Come to me and I will show you. You will have everything in joy. The voice is a voice of joy. Come to me and I will show you. You will have everything in joy. The, the voice is a voice of joy. Chapter his holy books. From the words of Rabbi Yisrael concerning the greatness of Rabbeini and the worth of his holy books. Today, in these times, there will be revealed a bit of Rabbi Nachman of Breslov, who is above the Torah, above all the Tzvikim. He came to the world to rectify all the world, all the wicked, all the impure. Everyone will be clean and united with God with the Torah. Rabbi Nachman is the root and the main point. Every word that came from his holy mouth rises above everything. Every word of Rabbi from heaven, from God himself, all his words are truly the words of God. There are already pieces of advice from Rabbi from God. Rabbi received from God. Na na. If Rabbeinu were to be revealed in the world, all the world would be holy and true tzaddikim. Now, the light of Rabbeinu needs to come to the world. The Rabbi of all the Torah, of all the tzaddikim, such wonders are being revealed in the world, such wisdom, such truth, like nothing that was ever revealed in the world. And that is Rabbeinu. He is the key to everything. The force of evil closes and Rabbeinu opens. Rabbeinu opens all the gates of repentance and of everything, of all the rectifications. All the keys are with him. And with one key, he opens all the lights, something like this was never before in the world. The main thing is only Rabbeini. This needs to be shown to all the world, to all of Israel, all the time that this is still not revealed. We have nothing. The world without Rabbeini is. It has nothing, no vitality at all. Rabbeini rose above all the wisdoms, above all the Torah, above all the tzaddikim, above everything. Rabbeini is the father, the mother. He is everything. He is the Torah. He is faith. He is everything. Everything is Rabbeini. Without Rabbeini, we are lacking everything. Without him, we have nothing. With, with Rabbeini, with Rabbeini, everything. Everything is good. Rabbeini says that he teaches God how to relate to us. He gives him advice. Who said words like these? And he will rectify the whole world, each and every one completely, a full rectification. All the rectifications are dependent only on drawing close to Rabbeini, all our rectification, and that of the whole world dependent only on drawing close to Rabbeini. Rectifications, such rectifications that were never before in the world, he will rectify us and all the evildoers and all the evildoers and all the wicked. There are things that are impossible to repair, but he creates a new in one moment he illuminates the whole world ignites fire in the whole world he can create a new world in one moment everything is in his keeping the temple the holy of holies the foundation so the foundation stone everything is with him he rises above everything all the Torah is received from Rabbeini the holy of holies the holy of holies receives from Rabbeini everyone nurses from him he redeems and saves them he is everything everything is in his hands all the creation, all the world, all the Torah, all of Israel. This is a wondrous matter that was never before in the world. The time of the redemption has come. As much as we know is not a drop from the sea of the greatness of Rabbeini. Nothing comes into the calculation. It is all nothing before his greatness. I am the river that purifies from all the stains. Who, what Sadiq said such a thing, if not the Mashiach? All the redemption is dependent on Rabbeini. Everything, everything. The coming of the Mashiach and everything. If there is already Rabbeini in the world, there is already the Mashiach. The Mashiach will already 
find everything ready and waiting. Rabbeinu already prepared everything for the Mashiach. Rabbeinu already prepared everything. When the Mashiach comes, he will reveal Rabbeinu who he is. Who is Rabbeinu? Rabbi Nachman. The Mashiach will infuse the world with the light of Rabbeinu. The Mashiach will be a student of Rabbeinu. The Mashiach will be a student of Rabbeinu. The more that we know of Rabbeinu, the more the evil inclination goes and recedes and disappears. Rabbeinu kills him with all his troops. What there is in the world, such diseases, with no chance of any rectification, reaching them from any source of help, entirely, entirely lost. And he transforms everything. Sick people like us today, they have no healing. But Rabbeinu can rectify also diseases like these, can heal, can gladden. He can help all of Israel at every moment with one word. He heals all the diseases of all the ill people with one word. This is such a wonder that we're so sick, that we are so sick that no one can help us, even a drop from the sea. Only he, only he. He can heal all the ill in the world. Every word of Rabbeinu revives the dead. Everything. He said that there are diseases that have no cure. And I can heal also diseases like these. Sick people like these. I can help them. Even a sick person with no healing. I can heal him. E if we would know of this. Believe in this. We would be holy tzaddikim like none that ever were, were that like none that ever were in the world. Rabbeinu is such a secret. Unlike anything since the creation of the world. Such a wonder was never before in the world. Never before was there such a novelty in the world. New. Every word that Rabbeinu revealed in the world creates a completely new world. He said that every word is all the Torah and all the Tzadikim and all of Israel in one word and this way he can encompass all the Torah. One word from Rabbeinu overturns the, overturns the whole world. All the sages, he shows them that they don't know anything. He rose above all the leaders, above everything and his truth. There's no truth like this, no sage like this. All the world cannot stand in the face of one word from Rabbeinu. All the sages will all annul themselves entirely before Rabbeinu. All of them are maddened. All the leaders, all of them annul themselves in the face of words like these. Whoever saw words like these? Just one word from Rabbeinu includes all the world in its entirety. Every word of Rabbeinu is all the Torah in its entirety. Every word of his and every matter of his is above nature and he is eternal and he is always present in every generation. Thus he said uh, that thus he said that he is the true leader of all Israel in each and every generation. It is, un it is uninterrupted. It is uninterrupted. What he revealed to us still does not amount to a drop from the sea. Waha, we still do not know anything from Rabbeinu. We and all the world and all the generations yet to come is still not enough to attain one word from Rabbeinu. One could expire from the intensity of the vitality of every word that Rabbeinu revealed in the world. Every one of his words is a, is a spring, the sea of wisdom. One word is the great sea, the sea of wisdom, such a sea, a sea of new salvations and healings like this never before existed. One of his words that he revealed, it renews and heals the whole world all the heretics, all the wicked, completely complete heretics, and they will be holy Siddiquim. One word is enough for the whole world to see. The great sea is not enough to write of the greatness of Rabbeinu. May his memory be blessed in every one of his words. He can conquer the whole world. In every one of his words he can conquer the whole world. There there will be more times that I hope to God perhaps I will merit to strengthen myself in prayer and continue to and continue to relate what is Rabbeinu. Every word spoken about Rabbeinu is a great relief for the whole world. All the salvations of each member of Israel every day and at every time is with Rabbeinu. Rabbeinu is the choice of all the generations. He's the greatest healer in each and every generation. He is the greatest healer in each and every generation. Each of his words is a healing and a salvation for us, for us, and for all our generations. Forever to eternity, each and every teaching that Rabbeinu revealed is the fulfillment of all the Torah and faith. All our lives in this world, in the next world, it is only Rabbeinu. We, our main purpose is our main purpose is to be bound and attached to Rabbeinu. All that he says is true and firm and correct, and we need to give our souls to fulfilling every word that he revealed. Not to listen to anyone, not, nothing can help us. Only Rabbeinu Rabbi Nachman. Rabbeinu Rabbi Nachman is our Rebbe. He is our Rebbe and that of all Israel. He is the head of all the tzaddikim, of everything. The matter of Rabbeinu of blessed memory rises above everything, above all the great thinkers, above everything. In the face of Rabbeinu, everything is annulled. The matter of Rabbeinu is a matter that rises above everything in Rabbeinu himself. More and more and more. Part, not the part. In the chapter Nanach Nachmon Achmon Miyuman Nanach Nachmon Achmon Miyuman is the name of Rabbeinu, and, and this and in this encompasses the creation of the world. All the tzaddikim are included in this name. All the Torah and all the tzaddikim and all the wondrous lights and everything. All the generations never before was there a wonder such as this in the world from any tzaddik. Rabbeinu revealed this Nanach Nachmon Nachmon Miyuman is a new thing. Nanach Nachmon Nachmon Miyuman is greater and higher than everything. This rises above everything above all the Torah. Above 
hub of everything. Only na 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 na
sentence into hell, he would recite a teaching from the Kita Maran, then it would become paradise. This is already the Kita Maran. There is already the Kita Maran in the world. So everyone has a rectification. There is already the Kita Maran in the world. And the Kita Lachas and the Kita Tfilis, he will transform everyone into holy tzaddikim. All the heretics, all the wicked will be tzaddikim. Was there a Kita Maran like this since the creation of the world? One word of the Kita Maran includes all the tzaddikim and all the Torah. There are no words to speak. The Kita Maran, what this is, what this is, what a salvation this is, what a healing, what? This is all our rectification. This is everything it has in it. All that is needed to reach fear of heaven and faith and repentance. And all that one needs, it is all there in every single world, in every single word. No tzaddik ever said words like these. The Mashiach will give an interpretation of the Kitam Ram. So, he is the only one in all the world, the only one who said words like these. The Mashiach will give an interpretation of the Kitam Ram. All the great thinkers and all the leaders of the world will be ashamed and annulled before Rabbeinu, before one man, one word of the Kitam Ram triumphs over every Everyone, all the world, one word. The Kita Tfilis, the Kita Lachas, the Kita Maran. These are teachings of the Mashiach. Rabbeinu said, there is already the Kita Maran in the world, so the world will not be destroyed. Part the Kita Tfilis. The time has come for the Kitat Phyllis to be revealed in the world. We do not know anything of what effects it has on the world. Every word of it brings rectifications and vitality to the whole world. Such a Kitat Phyllis. All the world needs it at every moment. All the world, the Kitat Phyllis, needs to be printed for all the world. For all the yeshivas in every place, there will be the Kitat Phyllis. They will see if there was ever before something like this in the world. A wonder such as this, the Kitat Phyllis. Was there ever a Kitat Phyllis like this in the world? This is only from the Mashiach. This Lekitet Phyllis will be revealed by our righteous Mashiach. He will reveal what it, what is Lekitet Phyllis. The Mashiach will bring in the whole world, all of Israel, and rectify them. He will give them Lekitet Phyllis, and they will recite Lekitet Phyllis. That is all. The Mashiach, the Mashiach will give an interpretation of what is Lekitet Phyllis, what is Lekitet Alachis, what is Lekitet Aitis, what is Sipir Masis. The Mashiach will take each time some drop from the sea and say it, and everyone will become Siddiquim, complete Baalei Tshiva. Holy Tzadikim, everyone, the Kitet Phyllis makes Tzadikim. The Kitet Phyllis makes Tzadikim. There's, there is a Kitet Phyllis. There is a Lekitet Phyllis like this in the world. Who can say that there is even one word like those in Lekitet Phyllis in the world? Such a truth, such a teaching, such a Lekitet Phyllis was never before in the world. Prayers like these, nothing like them in the world. Such a Lekitet Phyllis that Rabbi, that Rabbi Nassim said explicitly about it. Never in history were there revealed prayers like these. Never have there been prayers like these in the world. Never have there been prayers like these in the world. Such a Lekitet Phyllis that every word can change the whole world from one extreme to the other. The whole world each word can heal, the, can heal the whole world, gladden the whole world, strengthen the whole world. Every word, the Kitet Phyllis, can receive the whole world. The Kitet Phyllis can receive the whole world. It will conquer the whole world. It will enliven and gladden and heal the whole world. All the wicked, all the heretics, it will heal and return them to the good. One word will transform the whole world. The Kitet Phyllis draws us close to the Torah and to God in truth. Every word of the Kitet Phyllis is the life of everyone. It gives life to all the world, to all the wicked. The Kitet Phyllis is the hospital of all the world. The Kitet Phyllis is the hospital of all the world. This will be the greatest joy in the world. It will be revealed. The Kitet Phyllis, I, the Kitet Phyllis, it is fitting for us to be very involved with this. One merits to such lights that were never before revealed in the world. If you have some sense, by the Kitet Phyllis and recite a great deal of the Kitet Phyllis and find vita vitality, eternal life, life that can be called life. One who recites the Kitet Phyllis, he finds the truth. May we merit to recite much from the Kitat Phyllis and much from the Kita Halachas. These are words of the Mashiach. Rabbeinu revealed a drop from the sea. Part the Kita Halachas. Rabbi Nassim, such a holy tzaddik, such a light. He wrote the Kita Halachas. The Kita Halachas, whose every word can give life to the whole world. The Kita Phyllis, the Kita Halachas, every word can revive the dead. The Kita Halachas, the Kita Aitzis, the books of Rabbeinu. That is the redemption, that is the Torah, and that is faith, and that is everything. Such teachings were never before in the world. World. Religious laws like these were never before in the world. H how could one apart even for one moment from the Kitet Phyllis, from the Kita Lachas? This rises above all the Torah. There is already the Kita Maran. There is already the Kitet Phyllis. There is already the Kita Lachas. These are teachings of the Mashiach. The Mashiach is also included in the words of Rabbeini. The Mashiach is also included in the words of Rabbeini. The teaching of Rabbeini is the Mashiach and more and more and more. 
Ibea Nachal, Ibea Nachal, all who see the letters becomes a Baal Chiva. Every letter is the light of God, every word the light of God, hidden from all the worlds. Make an effort to acquire the book Ibea Nachal, then you will be a Breslava Chusid. Tikan Aklali, part, tik, the part of the chapter Tikan Aklali, the Behini said. I am the river that purifies from all the sins, such from all the stains. I am the river that purifies from all the stains, such stains like we have. Who can clean them? Only Rabbeini. When one needs a healing, one should say, Tikana Klali, someone who fell, God forbid, then immediately he, he is as if nothing had happened. Tikana Klali, this is the light of the Mashiach, saying Tikana Klali by the grave of Rabbeini, this is a rectification of which we have no conception. Now, Rabbeini is already in the world, now there is already redemption, there is Lakita Maran and Lakita Tfilis and more. Rabbeini revealed a new wisdom that rises above all the wisdoms. It is all written in every word of Rabbeini, of blessed memory. In his holy books, there are all the rectifications and all the healings and all the salvations. This is all the salvations. The holy Torah to print the books of Rabbeini. This is the vitality of all the world. We need to give all our souls and posterity to this that there will be the books of Rabbeini in every place. Then the complete redemption will come. Such a redemption like none that was ever in the world. Any person who wants to have mercy on himself and on his children should buy the books of Rabbeini and be involved with them and fulfill what is written in them. Then there will be an entirely new world. Nanach nachmon achmon yuman completed and sealed. Nanach nachmon achmon yuman completed and sealed. Praise God, the Creator. Blessed is he who gives strength to the weary. Please note this text is the property of Karen Rabbi Yisrael Adesser. Nanach.net has received permission from Rav Amram Horovitz to distribute this text over the internet for people's personal use only. If you wish to reprint this text, for non-personal use, you must first receive permission from, from Rahav Amram Horovit. Na nach nachma nachma miyuman bi ayda yekushini in the radis lechu media yukal yagvin lechu in the nice milah mavad sechu in the echol matam vaget niyan in the shir lekim chazav yamach bavad sechu na nach nachma nachma miyuman b'zeh agal ad chusor chazav mavad sechu na nach nachma nachma miyuman b'zeh agal ad chusor vi mune b'gunish b'kav kap sar b'sari kev chiz gavod tonight simizav tamzia mishen kum sana na nach nachma nachma Oh, man.